Hey guys, it's Morgan coming to you with an install slash introduction video uh, for a new product. It's this right here. It's called Counter Shocks. It is a brand new suspension enhancing product. I don't really know what to call it other than its name, Counter Shocks, C O U N T E R S H O X. Check them out on all the socials. I'll put the links in the description. We're going to be installing them on my uh, 125XC right now. And when we do that, we'll be talking a little bit about what they do, but this is really just a setup for a bunch of testing and trying it out because I'm excited. So anyway, let's install these things. All right guys, so first things first, we gotta take the wheel off the bike um, and because we're gonna need to slide this fork down to put the mounts over the fork. So just gonna yank the wheel off like you normally would. All right guys, so wheels off now. We're gonna loosen the triple clamps. When you're doing this, you gotta be careful not to uh, let the fork just drop to the ground. It's not the end of the world, but if anything, it's just kind of embarrassing, so. Now, you're gonna take the bigger one. So if you look at these, you'll see one is thicker, one's thinner. The thinner one is a bigger inside diameter. And we're gonna come over here, and I'm mounting it on the right because my brake line and my wires and everything like that are over on the left, so I'm mounting it to the right. You can mount it however you want, but you want to put it so where, and I'll show you up close, the Allen is aimed out and back. So put the big one on first, then the smaller one back in where it goes. So I'll worry about getting these torqued correctly. You want 17, or excuse me, 12 newton meters here and 17 newton meters here anyway. So we'll get them torqued correctly later. I have, I'm running this uh, Showa steering stabilizer on here. So I have a bit of a different situation because I can't put it all the way inboard. So we're gonna figure out exactly where it can go and then you know it'll be good. We'll, we'll have it all dialed in, but um, yeah, you'll see. So now you want to take these clamps off. Okay, so here's the counter shocks. And what you gotta do, what you want is the big part, <laughs> this big red piece up and this down. And we're gonna get it as far down as close to the top of this triple clamp as we can. So this is still above it, but we're gonna get that on there. And, and then I'll show you kind of how I'm planning on setting this thing up. Like all things, guys, with multiple bolts and bolt holes and all that stuff, you want to just install everything loose to start so you can move things around and then uh, once you get it where you want it, you can tighten everything down. All right. So they're all still a little bit loose, so I can rotate and move this thing. And so I want it Check this out, this is pretty cool. I was a little bit worried it wasn't gonna work on this, but I think it's gonna work just fine. It clears that, no problem. It doesn't have any problem, you know, turn that way, there's no issue. It comes this way, it actually clears it just fine. So I'm gonna tuck it right in like that. That's exactly what I want, just like that. Perfect, because no matter how hard I go, it will not hit that. So that's perfect. Now, all we're gonna do is I'm going to tighten these four bolts down, then we'll come back here, tighten these pinch bolts down, and we'll be good to go. All right, guys, it's mounted up. Looks good. Nothing hits anything. I'm super happy with it. So now let's talk a little bit about what this thing is. Because, <laughs> yeah, I am uh, a little skeptical, probably like you guys are because like what the heck is that going to do to anything um but the guy nathan who developed this thing is a really 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 smart guy also a really really fast guy and he came up with this idea and basically i don't know yeah i don't know the best way to describe it basically there's a frequency at which your wheel moves up and down on your bike while you're riding and this thing helps to counteract that frequency effectively keeping the bike from topping out too hard or bottoming too hard. It's, it's counteracting everything that you do, uh, which then stabilizes the front end a whole bunch. 
Now, I have not yet used it. It was brand new. I just got this thing in the mail today. So I'm super excited to try this thing out. Huge thanks to Nathan and Countershocks. Thank you guys very much for trusting me enough to test this thing and believe in me enough to know that I'll be honest, like <laughs> brutally honest about it. So um, you guys know here on the YouTube channel, I'm honest. If I don't like something, I'm going to tell you. He knows that if I don't like it, I'm going to tell him. But he is so, so confident that I'm going to love this thing. Um, so, yeah, and he's friends with a bunch of friends. So he's a legit guy, and I think we're going to be good. So anyway, that's the Counter Shocks install, guys. Quick discussion of what it does. Basically, there's things inside there that counteract. and move. Anyway, I don't, whatever. I don't know. But he's got a patent on it, so <laughs> it's all him. Uh, yeah, we're going to take this thing out and test it this weekend. We're going to go hammer down and uh, see how it does. And that guy is saying he's going to whip my butt. What do you guys think? You think the kid's going to whip my butt? <laughs> Guess in the comments below. Um, I'm actually going to, actually real fast, you know what? Stick with me here for this video for just a little bit longer. I think I'm going to put this wheel on. I got a set of rocks out front. I'm going to just go hammer through them and see what happens. All right, guys, so I took it out, banged it through the rocks. It's just like this little rock garden. Landscaping really is what it is. <laughs> it's out there. I uh, ran through the rocks, and I think I can feel a difference. I like it's gonna take. I gotta get out and actually get my gear on and hammer and whatever. But I think that I can feel a difference, which is interesting because honestly, I it's weird, right? That something like that would make a difference. Science behind it makes sense. Like I said, please go and check out Countershock C O U N T E R S H O X on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube to learn more um, because. There's more information there. He obviously doesn't give everything away because it is a patented product. He doesn't want people reverse engineering it and all that good stuff. But I think it works. But here, check it out. Behind the number plate, I had to carve a little bit of the number plate out um, just to make it fit, but it works great. It's all tucked in there, doesn't hit the steering stabilizer. I'm excited, guys. I'm really excited to hammer on this. Like you know, I'm gonna be honest. Um, you're gonna know whether I think it works or doesn't work. It's cool since it has the uh, bolts to just pop it off. I'll be able to go run through a section without it, then run through with it and tell you exactly uh, how it feels. So that's going to be awesome. Anyway, hope you guys like that video. I think it's a pretty cool um, thing, and we'll definitely check it out.